Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to be presenting you how to assemble the Epson TM30 printer. Uh, basically, this is a brand new printer out of the box. Um, the first thing you want to do is actually turn it this way. And on this end here, you can just take this piece apart. Then you'll take this piece apart. And as you can see here, you will find your Ethernet cable, USB, and power cable. So the first thing we're going to do is connect it to the power on our side. Make sure that the other end is not connected to power. So just this end first, the other end just be, you know, outside of the wall. The next thing would be to connect the Ethernet cable. So, here's the cable here. And we will take a look at this. So you hear a little quick, so you have ethernet and the power cable. So our printer is gonna be connected to Quantic POS and um, Quantic uses ethernet uh, for all the printers, okay? So we'll put this thing back. Oops. Put that the way around, so, oops, this way up. All right, and then on this side up. Okay, it's all nice and hidden. Last thing will be to put to put the paper. And finally, we'll need to connect the power cable to the power. Power adapter, I'm sorry. Okay. So now the printer is connected. We're gonna turn the printer on. And give it a few seconds to load. Good. right now the printer printed the IP address which is the local IP address as you can see over here our next step would be to go into the POS settings and find that printer okay so in the POS settings we will put in your password go on the top three uh, three lines on the top left corner click on hardware click on printers in here we're gonna click on scan printers this is an Epson TM M30. As you can see, this IP address here match what we have on the receipt that was printed. So we'll just click on add and we have to give it a name, printer one. Group, select your group. If you're using a cash drawer, make sure you select this. The cash drawer also has to be connected into the back end of the printer, okay? Printer type is thermal, printer brown is Epson, and we'll press on save. Now when you click on this, this is our printer one, so we'll press on it. And as you can see, it's online. If you're using it for just regular receipt printing, so you click on receipt printing, that should be it. We'll do a demo print. And something did print out, so that means that we're good. We'll also do a demo test. And as you can see, we have green here. We're basically done now. We're just gonna do a final test. We'll do a cash sale. And we will print a customer copy. And as you can see, everything printed, all good.